Hello and welcome. This is Ahmed of our channel, and in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to tune up or increase the speed of the fan that came uh, with the cooling pad of the laptop. Here we have this model, which is Pro Bromate, uh, which has a four fans. Everyone has a speed of 1200 per minute. Uh, what this may sound quite enough for a normal laptop ordinary laptop or for work laptop but when it comes to a gaming laptop this may not uh, fulfill the condition uh, so here we have a way to increase the speed of these fans much much better and you will uh, notice uh, a huge uh, difference uh, without uh, opening or changing any of the component of this pad uh, neither uh, opening a single screw all our work will focusing on the USB cable so let's go uh, with the next slide uh, here we have uh, as it comes with most of the cooling pad uh, two USB uh, inputs as a hub this works as a hub for example if you uh, use a USB to connect it to your laptop here we have this segment uh, as a Alternative to the laptop, uh, the USB uh, input that we uh, we lost from the laptop, so you will not lose any of the laptop USB, and at all. And here we have the adjustable or turning the speed of the fans here for the upper fans and here for the lower fans. Let's first connect any ordinary USB cable, for example. Uh, which must you uh, you have not used it so much for example let's say uh, the f mobile phone USB cable which has one USB cable uh, like this and the other end is a uh, type C or you could use uh, a male to male USB cable uh, the way you like uh, what we're gonna do is to cut one end of the USB which must, must not be the end uh, that it's connected to the uh, cooling pad so we start with the other end when we cut it we may found, uh, found it's covered with this braid uh, this braid is like a cover or uh, and uh, inside this cover is like a foil foil is a silver foil and inside this foil you may find uh, four uh, wires uh, two wires which is twisted and two is what uh, is demanded here in this tutorial which we are going to use it uh, those twisted wires for uh, uh, transferring the uh, da data and those two uh, black and so a uh, black and red are for uh, as a power conductors so we're going to work on these two things so after we cut this and we after we remove the braid and after we uh, seal uh, unseal the foil and we have got four wires as you can see in this uh, here uh, the uh, green arrow is uh, highlighted the foils and the braids cover uh, and uh, here we have the four uh, wires which is the uh, green uh, red black and white what we need now is the black and, uh, and red we extract only the red and uh, and the black and we fold up away the unwanted other contents now there is things must be kept in mind uh, what uh, our aim here is to provide a bore adapter that could uh, 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 or could uh, let's say supply a better uh, volts than 5 volts uh, at the same time provide a uh, higher ampere right, so we could show we fulfill the fans there as uh, we could we need to have to check the cooling pad for the required amount uh, here we have the f input 5 volts which is ordinary for all USBs uh, but we could maybe use uh, 9 volts as uh, maybe it could be safe safe for the fans so you would not be fried any of the components and the bow adapter must be higher than this uh, uh, has a higher amperage or the same as this amperage 
so uh, you will not uh, otherwise if you use uh, uh, a lower than uh, this fault uh, up here you may notice uh, a fluctuation in the speed of the fans so here we use uh, a bow adapter which has uh, as you could see in this oh yeah so I forget to uh, rotate so things may be clearer uh, here we have this uh, output the most important thing is the output uh, it supplies with the uh, 9 volts and with the uh, 2100 mm mm ampere hey, uh, so here uh, it's quite fulfill uh, the condition here and you can may not see any difference uh, but don't use more than this uh, more than uh, volt than this uh, this could uh, harm the fans so I found this is quite uh, suitable and I use it so much so I didn't encounter any issues with the fans and we need to cut the other end of this power adapter to extract the two wires which is the negative and the positive uh, well we can't identify the uh, positive and the negative here even though this will not cause any much trouble here as you could see uh, here we have the black and red of the USB cable that is connected to the cooling pad and here we have the negative and positive uh, wires which is connect, uh, which is uh, related to the bar adapter. Uh, the first thing, uh, the next thing we need to, we have to do is connecting the bar adapter to any circuit, and we need to give a try to con uh, to replace, uh, to connect the sync, for example, the left one with the red uh, wires, or connect the left one with the black wires, and vice versa until we. We could uh, see the uh, cooling fan is operated well. This will not harm if, you, if there is a difference in the bolt. Uh, but when you read the correct bolts or how they how they are fascinate, uh, fascinated, then uh, uh, and how it works, then that you hit the right bolts. And let's go to the next slide. Uh, and after that, we need to fold away the unwanted uh, contents of or constituents of the USB cable, which is the white and the green wires and the foil and the braid uh, leaving only the uh, red and the black wires which is the uh, conductor that's connected to the bar adapter uh, now we have to apply the tape uh, to the all the un unwanted uh, con constituents as I, s I said the two wires the w uh, white and the green wires and the braid on uh, and the foil and separate them and now we have to uh, when now we have those two wires which is the bore adapter with the bore and the conductor uh, now we need to fold every two uh, wires uh, need to separate or fold everyone on the other side so we sh make sure they will not get in contact and cause a short circuit uh, and now we must apply a tap to a tape to every to uh, to every two wires that connected. For example, the black wires with that connected to the bar adapter, uh, fold it away and apply a tape. And after that, we are moving to the other one and apply a tape until we se fully separated them. As you can see in this photo, uh, here it comes when you connect the bar adapter again. And you could see there is a huge difference in the fan speed, and you could not not suddenly hear uh, the sound of the fans as uh, at its full speed. And I hope you get uh, and benefit from this uh, tutorial. And uh, please subscribe to my channel. Hope you uh, do that, and you get any benefits. And goodbye.